Some are calling it a miracle after a car drove into a Bonnetot County daycare center without killing anyone. Yes, yeah, state police say four people were hurt, two babies, a teacher, and of course the elderly driver. 10 News reporter Sydney Jacks-Timer gives us a look at the damage left behind and what's next for this local business. The owner of Children's Nest here in Blue Ridge tells me the SUV came through this wall and into the daycare center. You can see it entered into the infant room. You can see debris everywhere. This actually used to be a wall dividing this room. Drywall, wires, broken cribs. And the owner tells us it's a true testament to God that no one was killed. A parent's worst nightmare came true for families at Children's Nest Learning Center. When owner Rhonda Spangler heard a car had driven into her daycare, she rushed to the scene. When I did get here and I did see all the children and all the babies and everybody outside safe, um, I just knew that it was a miracle that God was in this place and that he was watching over us. State police say four people were hurt, including the driver, identified as 84-year-old Bertha Elliott. A teacher at the daycare center was among those hurt. We're told she's in the ICU, as well as two babies who are still recovering in the hospital. Spangler credits her staff for doing everything they could to keep the children safe. There's no way you can train for what happened yesterday. They just did a, an exceptional job. They definitely deserve all that honor. As for what's next for the daycare, they plan to rebuild. In the meantime, the community is stepping up to help. We do have someone that's reached out um, to offer their facilities to us, um, and we're trying to get that right now nailed down with our state so that we can do that in the near future. In Botetourt County, I'm Sydney Jacks Timer 10 News, working for you.